Hi everybody, Dr. Joseph Cipriano here. Just wanted to let you know that I'm doing two giveaways every month in 2019. This next month coming up, we are starting off, we're gonna be doing a $200 PayPal giveaway. Now, to be entered to win the $200, uh, first, you need to be subscribed to the channel. Uh, second, you need to like the video. Third, I want you to tell me what you do with the $200. So leave a comment saying what you're going to do with that $200. Make sure and share the video to as many people as you can. So subscribe, like, share, comment why, and sorry, not why you need it, but what you're going to do with the money. <laughs> How did that feel? <laughs> Speechless. Yeah, yeah, I felt it all the way. Like, like an accordion. <laughs> Hi everybody, I'm Dr. Joseph Cipriano and today we have our patient here. Um, so now after looking over the paperwork and then obviously we're talking with you, uh, you've got a little bit both going on. You've got the right leg is sciatic pain and you feel it coming from that low back going down now you as you told me you have a herniated disc do you know which level that was again uh lumbar okay the lumbar spine okay so we've got a lumbar herniated disc and then also and this is more recent this left shoulder correct yeah um i'd probably say maybe five months ago okay so five months with this left shoulder now it's locking up as you described it yeah um I'll go to turn or do something and I'll get stuck as okay. I as I like to put it I'll lock up and I just have to like kind of force myself to move okay all right so that means we've got a left-sided upper right-sided lower so we're definitely going to focus on everything so you definitely came to the right place we're going to do that full body adjustment today um, first what I'm going to do I'm going to just kind of get a little um, Kind of a beginning point, let's see where you are at. Um, what I want you to do, I want you to look all the way up at the ceiling for me. Any pain, tenderness, tightness with that? Tightness. Tightness, just in the neck? Yeah. Okay. And then if you look down to the floor, any issues with that? Uh, tenderness. Tenderness, where it's? Uh, the base of the neck. Base of the neck, okay. And then if you bring one ear to one shoulder, any issues with that? Tightness. Okay, and then to the other side? Uh, sore, but I feel it like in my shoulder. Okay, and that's obviously yeah. that chief complaint side. Um, do you have any issues just with raising that arm up? No. Or like bringing it forward, backwards? Like, is there anything? A little with bringing it back. Okay. Is there anything in particular that sets that off, or is uh, it random? It it can be random. Okay. Um, lifting some stuff sometimes, but okay. um, most of the time it's when I try to like, turn. Okay. I notice this when it locks up. Gotcha, okay. So I'm going to do some orthopedic tests in the cervical spine, so I'm going to have you sit up nice and straight. We're going to push down on the top of your head. Any pain with that? No. Good. And have you turn to the side. Any pain with that? Yeah. Okay, where at? The shoulder. The shoulder? Yeah. Okay. Now, did you feel it coming like from like it the goes, neck? It goes or? like around my shoulder blade. Okay, okay. And have you turn to this side? Any issues with that? No. Okay, good. We're going to lift up. Any increase in pain, decrease in pain, or no change? No, no change. Okay. I'm going to have you stand up for me. So, I'm going to have you bend forward at the waist. Any pain with bending forward? No. Okay, and then if you uh, extend backwards. Yeah. Okay, this is where you get pain. Yeah. Is that going down that right it, leg? Yeah. Straight down. Okay. And you said that only goes into... About mid-calf. Mid-calf, okay. Um, your feelings just run down there? It's around the side. Okay, so it's around the side, just going down mid-calf. Doesn't go into the toes or anything. Okay. If you're too laterally bent from one side to the other, any issues with that? No? Okay. And then if you're to rotate. On the shoulder. Okay, so rotating. You're feeling like, when, almost like when you bring that rib cage back, you mm -hmm. almost feel something catching. Yeah. And I guess that's, yeah. Okay, and then that's when I would almost lock in place at a time. Okay. I am going to have you lay on your back for me. I just want to do a couple orthopedic tests on that lower back. Leg straight for me. Alright, I'm going to raise this leg up. Let me know if you have any pain in your low back or your hips. My hips. Your hips? Yeah. Right on the outsides? Okay. We're going to bend this knee. 
cross it. And as we come down, any pain in the low back of the hips with that? Both. Both? Okay. Let's check this set. Any pain in the low back of the hips? The low back. The low back. Okay, no, I'm done with that one. Gotcha. I'm going to have you flip over on your stomach, and I'll, I can take your glasses for you. Thank you. You're Okay. So now, how I like to start every adjustment, one, we're going to scan the entire body. So we're going to scan from that cervical spine, going all the way down to the legs, and then we're going to be checking the symmetry from the right side of the body and comparing it to the left side of the body. Um, so I'm going to start palpating. Let me know if anything is tender to the touch when I push in, okay? Okay, so we're going to start in that cervical spine here into the thoracic spine. Right there. Right here, okay. We're gonna keep going lower. Now, right there. Okay, now we're getting that to the bottom of the thoracic, top of the lumbar spine. Yeah, right there. Right there, yeah. okay. So we've got multiple spots in that lumbar spine. When I push over the right SI joint, any pain with that? A little bit. Okay. Directly over the sacrum? Not really. Okay. And left side? No. Okay. So just a little bit over that right SI joint, but there were multiple um, trigger points when I was pushing in on that lumbar spine. So we're going to come down to here. Let's check out that leg length. So as you guys can tell, she's pulling short on that right side here. So that we will just definitely monitor and keep up with. And then as we're scanning up the body, um, two spots that I'm noticing, we got raised up a little bit right in here on that left side, but then also right through here, um, this is raised up. So it looks as if there's just a, I mean, a minor, very, very minor scoliosis, but it looks like those two spots are what we're seeing here. Um, well, let's go ahead, I wanna relax your back first so we're going to use the Hypervolt, that massage device, and we're going to work from uh, that upper back, just going all the way down into the lower back for you. Sound good? Sounds great. Okay. How does that feel? It feels really good. <laughs> okay. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna start with the adjustment. Now, I like to always start all the adjustments from that cervical thoracic junction up top here. Okay, so we're gonna start on that left side, hit T3 on the left here. Okay, we're gonna come up to T2 on the right. 
Feel how that just opens everything up for you? Yeah. Good. Okay. So I'm gonna have you take a deep breath in and exhale out. Good. One more time, deep breath in and out. There we go. Okay. So let's come down here. Let's recheck that leg length. That's a lot better. Almost perfect, but as you guys can tell, still pulling right short. So we're gonna come all the way down to that sacrum. We're gonna stabilize the sacrum. I want you to raise the right leg up as high as you can. Any pain, tenderness, tightness with that? Tightness. Tightness, okay, relax that side. Raise this side for me. How does that side compare to the right? It's easy. It's easy? Okay. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna have you cross your right leg over, your, over the left. Yep. And we're gonna do the drop technique. So the table's gonna come up like that from below. So what's happening is the sacrum is being tilted, it's angled a little bit towards that left side. So what we're going to do, we're going to do a P to A, meaning posterior to anterior, and we're going to do a counterclockwise um, rotation here with that drop. So we're going to torque it to bring it back to the midline here. Let's get two more in. And one more. There we go. And relax. Raise that right leg up for me. How does that feel? Better. Easier to lift up? Good. We're going to come down to here. Let's recheck that leg length. Still right short. So what that's telling me after we realign that sacrum, now we have the lumbar spine to work with. So now this was where originally when we were pushing in, you were getting some pain. So if I'm going through, how does that feel? It's very tender. Okay, very tender. So what I'm gonna have you do, and actually I don't want you to get caught on that. I'm gonna have you lay on your side and face me. So we're gonna bend that top knee, keep that bottom one straight. Good, there we go. There it was. How'd that feel? <laughs> Flip to the other side for me. Lay flat on your back. See, you know, the one thing good with adjusting you, you relax very easily. So, I don't have to force or thrust even that hard. You move very easily. Okay. Still a tiny bit short on the right. So what we're going to do, we're going to do that leg pull. Um, with that leg pull, you'll feel some release in the ankle and the knee going all the way up to that hip. That ankle unlocks quite a bit with that one. Oh. Yeah, that first one, I really felt that hip yeah. pull apart. And for you, that's going to be probably a really good one, considering that's where you get a lot of that sciatic pain. All right, I'm going to have you stand up for me. And I'll have you come right here. Good. One more step forward, right there. Good. Arms out by your side. Put your hands up and over mine. Good. Lean back on the way. Squeeze your elbows together. There we go. Feel how that just released? 
Yeah. <laughs> Good. Take your seat right here and face in that way. Okay. So I'd like to always do um, three adjustments as you know with the thoracic spine. So I start off with the prone thoracic adjustment, then we do that standing intercostal, mm -hmm. and now I like to do that anterior or supine um, thoracic adjustment. And the reason I do that is um, just the different techniques. They, some will work a little bit better, some I may not actually get all the pressure off the nerves on one technique, so that's why I do a, a couple multiple. So take a deep breath in, and exhale out. Alright, and relax with that. So you can just relax your hands and your stomach for me. So now we're going to do the wire strap. Now I know this is probably the main reason yeah. I came. Now you actually came from pretty far away, from Virginia, correct? Yeah. Alright, how far of a drive was that? Four hours. Four hour drive. So that was a pretty decent amount of a drive there. Can I have you pull your hair through for me? Okay. And relax. Okay, so this is that Y strap, that decompression technique. Yep, and just relax. <laughs> and lay there, relax. <laughs> How did that feel? <laughs> Speechless. Yeah. <laughs> Let me take this some from underneath you and just lay, relax. You feel how that decompressed that spine? Yeah, I felt it all oh. <laughs> like like an accordion. <laughs> relax, yeah, you're good. You don't need to move right now. Take it in. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, you can really tell. So when that when that pressure while she's getting comfortable. While that pressure um, is built up, I mean, literally between the entire spine, you know, what happens, you know, just over the years, you have pressure uh, that gets put on the nerves and you have gravity pushing down on you. I mean, whatever you're doing for work, sitting, standing, desk job, your posture's incorrect. So all different, you know, stresses are being put on the nerves. And when we do that Y strap, it's literally pulling from the bottom and one quick pull, he felt that go Oh yeah, just all the way down. And it removes pressure off those nerves. And when you remove that pressure, it allows the body to function and to heal as it's intended. So if you were to describe that Y strap to somebody who's never had that done, what, um, would, you, what would you tell them? Getting cracked like a glow stick. <laughs> <laughs> it, it feels great. Feels great? Yeah, it's amazing. <laughs> Come on up. Yeah, you felt that go all the way down. Yeah, that, that was, was that was Powerful incredible. adjustment, huh? 100%. <laughs> Alright, so you remember when you first came in, um, I had you do those ranges of motion, looking up, looking down, standing up. I want you, oh. You may need those. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yes. Your eyesight. Um, run through them again for me. Alright, looking up, fine. Looking down, fine. Yeah, I have no pain in the shoulder. No pain in the shoulder? Yeah. Good. And then... Yeah, when you stood up. And then it was up. Yeah. Nothing. Looking back. Yeah, it's... Fine. See, the, I think the one when you stood up last time, when you're leaning back, that was the only one, and you felt that go, mm -hmm. go down into the, into the calf. Yeah. And this time? Nothing. Nothing. Feels great. <laughs> was it worth the trip? Oh, 100%. <laughs> one, one, 100%. That was great. Good, good. Thank yeah. you so much. Perfect. You're very welcome. <laughs> so if anyone is looking to schedule um, an appointment, just go right to the website, drjosephcipriano.com. Um, send us a message and I'd love to get you in here. Have a good one everybody.